Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, adapter design pattern implementation. Before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch adapter design pattern introduction, adapter design pattern class diagram and sequence diagram video tutorial and also watch uh, adapter design pattern uh, real time example video tutorial. Then come and watch uh, this tutorial so that you can understand uh, this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Okay, now we will see the scenario. Uh, first then uh, i will show you the class diagram and uh, uh, the code related to that okay so the right side uh, you can see the electrical uh, socket okay and left side you can see the mobile phone and this electric socket will produce 220 volt okay and uh, what this uh, mobile phone is needed is 9 volt to charge right okay now uh, if you see this one this uh, mobile phone we cannot directly connect to the electrical uh, socket right so this phone and the electric socket are incompatible so to make it work together we have to introduce adapter in between so we have uh, adapter uh, this is nothing but uh, mobile charger so one end of uh, mobile charger we can connect to the electric socket and another end we can connect to the mobile phone so what this uh, charger will uh, do is it will convert uh, 220 volt to 9 volt okay then it will give that 9 volt to the mobile phone so that mobile co mobile phone can charge properly okay so here uh, this mobile charger is nothing but adapter okay so for this scenario uh, we will see how we can uh, uh, do class diagram and also uh, we can uh, see the code related to uh, this scenario okay okay uh, this is the class diagram of the scenario which we have just seen so right side uh, we have electric socket right which produce uh, 220 volt so corresponding to this electric socket I created electric socket class which will have uh, get volt method which returns volt okay and uh, this get volt method will return 120 volt to the caller and uh, left side we have mobile phone and it need 9 volt to charge right so corresponding to this uh, mobile phone I created mobile phone class and it has main method and it has uh, charge me method okay and in between uh, we have adapter which is nothing but a mobile charger so this uh, mobile charger will convert 220 volt to 9 volt and uh, it will give 9 volt to mobile phone right so corresponding to this uh, mobile charger i created a mobile phone charger class and which has uh, get 9 volt method and uh, this mobile phone charger implements uh, i target uh, this i target has get 9 volt method which is abstract method so this abstract method get 9 volt will be implemented by mobile phone charger and what this get 9 volt method will do is uh, it will it will call electric socket get volt method and it will get 120 volt then convert that 120 volt to 9 volt and uh, given the given uh, 9 volt back to the mobile phone so that the mobile phone can uh, charge properly okay basically this charge me method will call this get 9 volt method okay and uh, so this is a class diagram of uh, the scenario which we have just seen and i will show you the code in eclipse okay okay i have opened uh, eclipse uh, we can see the code now So here we have uh, volt class and I will open uh, volt.java so you can see volt uh, class and it has uh, volts uh, defined as int and if you want to create a volt object you have to just call this constructor and it has a getter and setter method for volts and the next class is electric socket which has get volt method I will open electric socket.java 
so it has a get volt method so what this method returns is uh, 120 volt to the caller next we have i target interface and uh, mobile phone uh, charger class i will open i target uh, interface first <coughs> so we have i target interface and it has get 9 volt method and i will open uh, mobile phone charger so this mobile phone charger is nothing but adapter which implements i target so i target has get 9 volt method so this mobile phone charger implements i target interface so it will uh, provide implementation of uh, this get 9 volt method okay and what this get 9 volt method will do is it will call electric socket uh, get volt method and electric socket will return 120 volt to the uh, mobile phone charger then what we are doing is we are converting that uh, 120 volt to 9 volt then uh, we are returning 9 volt to the color okay and uh, next is uh, mobile phone so i will open uh, mobile phone dot java so it has uh, charge me method and uh, it has main method so main method is calling this charge me and uh, what this charge me method will do is uh, it will call uh, mobile phone uh, charger get 9 volt method okay. and uh, what mobile phone charger will do is uh, it will call uh, electric socket get 120 volt convert 120 volt to 9 volt and it will give back uh, 9 volt to the mobile phone then using the 9 9 volt the mobile mobile phone will uh, charge uh, properly okay i will run this uh, code you can see the output so this is the output of uh, this program from electric socket mobile phone charger cut 120 volt okay then uh, mobile phone charger converted uh, 120 volt to 9 volt and uh, finally uh, mobile phone is charging using 9 volt okay and you will open class diagram again so I think you understood uh, adapter design button implementation uh, using this uh, mobile phone uh, charger example, right? And I have put together all this uh, sample code in my blog called ram j 2 e You can uh, just visit this site and get the sample code. And this is about adapter design button implementation. Thanks for watching. Bye.